Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to add Google Maps Street View in your Android app. In your Android app. Now let's start this video. Before starting, make sure to add the dependency in the build.gradle. Here is the dependency which you had to add. I will mention this dependency in the description box below. Now inside the main activity main.xml, create a fragment. Specify width as match parent and height as wrap content. Specify ID Google Maps Street View Now specify name as com dot google dot android dot gms dot maps support street view panorama fragment now here change constraint layout into relative one Now specify layout center in parent as true. Now here create a floating action button. Specify width and height as wrap content. Align parent bottom to true. Align parent right to true. Specify source at the rate on Android. Dialog map. Specify ID as fab. Here we have successfully created our layout. Now go into main activity dot java here create implements on street view panorama ready callback now implement these methods here create variable for street view panorama Second location now inside on create create support fragment Now inside it, create support street view fragment, create support, create support fragment manager dot end fragment by id r dot id dot google map street view make sure the id is same it is google maps street view now use the street view fragment dot get street view to this now create variable for floating action button
id by id r dot id dot fab now set on click listener for fab button but set on click listener new view dot on click listener inside it we have created variable second location use it Once we view panorama ready, two, two, street view panorama. Here is the variable str street view panorama. Now inside on street view panorama ready method, create street view panorama ready is equal to. Street view panorama. Second location. Then street view panorama dot set position. Here we have to specify latitude and longitude for the location. I have already found it. This is the latitude and longitude. Street view source. Dot outdoor. Now create else condition. Now street view panorama. Dot set position. New. Latitude and longitude for the another position. Both of these are having the same latitude and longitude. Now create. Street view panorama. Dot set street name enable to true. Street view panorama. Dot set ending gesture enable to true. Street view panorama. Set zoom gesture enable to true. Speed dot set user navigation enable to true. Speed view panorama dot animate to inside this you have to create new speed view panorama. Camera dot builder dot orientation YouTube panorama orientation specified to twenty and twenty. Dot zoom. Street view panorama. Dot get panorama camera. Dot zoom. And after this, provide dot build. Now, street view panorama. Dot set. On street view panorama camera, change listener to so, 
Seperti kan Roma. Here we have to set it for Panorama Change Listener. Now we have to create a method. Private Street View Panorama. Not on Street View Panorama Change Listener. Panorama Change Listener. New Street View Panorama. Not on Street View Panorama Change. Here we have to post a message. Location updated. Here we have finished completed coding in your main activity.java file. Now go inside the Android manifest. Provide the permission. Specify internet permission. Use this permission as a fine access. Fine location. Use this permission course location now inside this here create a metadata specify android name com dot google dot android dot geo dot api key Android value. Here we have to specify our API key. Here is my API key, which I have been already created. Now here we have finished or completed our coding. Now run the app and see the output. Make sure to run your app in the real device. Here our app has been successfully created. Now we will see the output of the app. Here is our app. I have added the latitude and longitude for the Melbourne cricket ground. Here we can see the cricket ground. Now as on we click on the app button. We will give the outside view. Here is the outside view. As we click on this button. This is the location changer. We will give, go to the forward or backward. Here we have successfully created our app. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Comment below if any doubt occurs.